So. All right, so what do you know about her boobs? Maybe Crystal could teach you a thing. Yeah, or two. have you experienced one yet? Um, I have. It's been indoors, but. Yeah, that's the best place. Um, not quite the same. <laughs> but uh, yeah, no, I know that uh, they're giant sandstorms and get up to 6,000 feet. Uh, I was just learning about them over here, and they can move uh, extremely fast. Yeah. Why don't you head over there and help Crystal out? Come on over, Steve. I think you're ready to All tell right. everybody what's happening inside that Haboob globe. So what's going on? <clears throat> All right, so we got a down pressure right here from a thunderstorm. <laughs> All right, this is what happens. It kicks up this dust right here, and it moves fast. It moves, like I said, moves up to 60 miles an hour. All right, it can get up over 6,000 feet. So if in your car, you're in your car, you see a boob coming, it is not the mummy. It is a sandstorm that's coming. <laughs> you need to turn around and drive the other way. That's what you need to do. Get in your house. They happen about two to seven times a year. If you're not from Arizona, you will be terrified. I can tell you that right now. Wow, that's sage oh advice. Run. That's sage advice. If this whole EMS seal already. <laughs> if this baseball thing doesn't work out, yeah. you have a backup plan. No, no, no. I don't look as good. You know. What I mean? <laughs> no, Steve, fantastic. Are you also a beer fan? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> well, join me for this graphic too. It's National IPA Day. So in celebration, what's on tap for today? We got o ozone high pollution. That's not a good one. No, that is not a good one. That's why you stay inside. Very That's why you stay inside and cling those glasses and celebrate. Yeah, right? Right. Yeah, 103, absolutely. 88 this evening with some light winds. You're familiar with our monsoon meter, right? You know that we could track when there's a potential for some dust storms, and uh, we've got some action in the higher terrain. What do you see for those numbers in the monsoon meter? <clears throat> like in the White Mountains, uh, there's a strong uh, percentage of a monsoon coming. If you're in northern Arizona, you're good. Don't worry, don't panic, enjoy your day outside today. Nice. But up in northern Arizona and the mountains, probably, sorry, this is western, I apologize, western Arizona. Northern and White Mountains, you're gonna wanna stay inside or grab an umbrella or two maybe. Man, you are rocking <laughs> it. Now I'm gonna jump to the seven day forecast. Um, I'm thinking roof closed, yeah, yeah, right? Yeah. <laughs> this is what we call hot. This is really hot. <laughs> so you're, you're not going to want to get out and play some golf today. That's for sure. <laughs> Maybe if you get in around uh, 7 a.m. or so, you'll be all right. But uh, we're going roof closed all weekend. Chances of thunderstorm on Saturday, some rain on Sunday. Every day this week, we got a chance of rain. 110 and just so humid out there. But you know what? The roof closed and the AC cranked in Chase Field. I say that's winning weather for the D backs this Absolutely. weekend. Yes. Absolutely. Fantastic, Steve. You rock. Oh, <laughs> Thanks, guys. I love it. Without you. All right, it's my turn. High five. <laughs> <laughs> Tag out. You're not going to let him touch traffic. That's right. <laughs>